U.S. Iran tensions live news updates At least 80 Americans terrorists were killed in missile attacks by Iran on two U.S. bases in Iraq on Wednesday, Iranian state media said, reported Reuters. The attacks were carried out in retaliation to the killing of Iranian military commander, General Qasem Soleimani. In a statement, Iran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps said, The fierce revenge by the Revolutionary Guards has begun. At least six rockets hit the Al-Assad Air Base in western Iraq at 1.20 a.m. local time, 2.50 east, the exact time Soleimani was killed in a U.S. airstrike at the Baghdad airport last Friday. Taji Base an Iraqi military base where U.S. troops are deployed, was hit in a second round of attacks two hours later. Iran Foreign Minister Javad Zarif later said the country does not seek escalation or war, but would itself against any aggression. An advisor to Iranian President Hassan Rouhani said that any U.S. retaliation to Iran's missile attacks could lead to an all-out war in the Middle East, hours after the attack. U.S. President Donald Trump said, all is well, and, so far, so good. Taking to Twitter, he said, all is well. He is expected to make a statement later today. The Indian government, meanwhile, issued a travel advisory and asked Indian nationals to avoid all non-essential travel to Iraq until further notification. DGCA also asked Indian Airlines to remain vigilant and take all precautions in the air space over Iran, Iraq Gulf of Oman and waters of Persian Gulf. By Express Web Desk, New Delhi, updated. January 8, 2020 11 hours 33 minutes and 59 seconds m.